This is the question from the metal cutting uh, gate 2022 set to question number 45 in the technical and uh, total 55th question in the paper. So, in the given problem, in an orthogonal machining operation, the cutting and thrust force are equal in the magnitude. So, cutting force is equal to the thrust force and the uncut chip thickness T is given as 0 0.5 mm and the CR angle is, uh, CR angle phi is 15 degree and the orthogonal rake angle of the tool is 0, alpha is given as 0 and the width of the cut B is 2 mm. So and the uh, this tau CR yield stress is given as 500 mega Pascal. So we have to find the cutting force Fc because Fc is equal to Ft here and rake angle is 0 so we first draw the merchant circle diagram for the same here so rake angle is 0 because so tool would be like tool would be like this and So this is FC this is Ft both are same in magnitude this is friction force F and this is N and uh, this friction angle would be the 45 because uh, Fc Ft are same so this is 0 this is also a square so this would be the friction angle would be the 45 degree and this is given in the problem shear angle as 15 degree so this also would be the 45 degree now Fc we have to find out now we know like uh, tau s is equal to f s by a s and uh, this is the f s this force would be the f s and this would be the normal force f and this is shear force f s so uh, now here f s we can find but uh, a s we have to know a s is equal to b t by sin phi B knows, T we knows, uh, sin 5 we knows, we will put B 0.5 T and sin 15. On solving we can get this 3.8637 mm square. So putting this value uh, on this AS, we can easily get the value of FS. FS would be the tau S is 500, tau S we can take from here, tau S is 500. So, FS we will be getting 1931.8516 Newton. This is the value of FS. Now, resultant force we can get because uh, we know the value here 45 and this is 15. So, total angle from the um, resultant is 60 degree. So, we can find the value of FS is R cos 60. So from here we can get the value of resultant force. Resultant force will be between uh, 3863.703 Newton. After getting resultant we can get any force here because it is square so it is a diagonal would be the root 2 times of the any side. So R would be the root 2 time of uh, this uh, any we can get Fn, Fs, Fc. Uh, so we have to find the Fc. So Fc would be the when we do the uh, root 2 times of this, so it will become 2732.05 Newton. So, this would be the final answer. For more details, we can go for this lecture series in the PTL. Uh, thank you.